Hi everyone, it's Jared here with Heat Press Nation, and I'll be putting the Nina Jet Cold DHS and Tax Print Sublimation papers in a head-to-head -head comparison. With Tex Print Sublimation papers standing as popular choices at Heat Press Nation, how exactly does Nina Jet Cold DHS compare when it comes to print quality and pressing time? If you've seen our video on Tex Print R versus XPHR, You'll know that the R paper leans toward natural colors ideal for photographs, while XPHR enhances contrast and saturation, allowing graphic designs to appear boldly on substrates. Now this is due to a difference in how both papers release their gas dyes, though both papers do require a decent amount of time to fully apply onto the substrates. Nina Jet Cold DHS is a paper specially made for hard substrates, offering photo quality transfers for half the pressing time whether you're applying it onto a coffee mug, photo panel, or any other hard substrate. To maintain its print quality, Jet Cold DHS holds more gas dye than most other papers, and it requires a different printing profile. As TextPrint XPHR is a bit similar in this regard, we'll be putting Jet Cold DHS and XPHR transfers head to head with Chromolux photo panels and 11 ounce Orca mugs. We'll start with the photo panels, pressed on a 13 by nine inch HPN Craft Pro so both the Jet Cold DHS and XPHR panels can be done at the same time. If you'd like to follow along, set your heat press to 50 seconds at 400 degrees Fahrenheit with medium pressure. While 70 seconds is the time you'd press one photo panel, you would only need 35 seconds when pressing one with Jet Cold DHS. We'll pretend that our XPHR panel has the same paper and add 15 seconds to our time, with our total at 50 seconds. With the two photo panels prepared, Go ahead and press them. When the timer hits zero, open the heat press and bring the panels out to cool down. Now it's time to peel the transfers off. Since metal sublimation blanks are a bit more lenient when pressed, these photo panels look surprisingly close to each other. Next up, we'll be testing the 11 ounce Orca mugs with an HPN Signature Series mug press. We won't be able to press two mugs at once, so the transfers will be pressed at their intended time lengths. As you can see, the difference is slight, but the Jet Cold DHS paper is still the winner with its well contrasted tones pressed at half the regular time. To learn more about these great sublimation papers and other sublimation products, please visit our website at heatpressnation.com. For any questions, you can give a call to one of our MyExpert representatives at 800-215-0894. Once again, I'm Jared with Heat Press Nation, and thank you so much for watching.